Hello Playtubers, it is Godzilla tonight for your coming at you with the first impressions video on the Godzilla 2002 SHMA reissue figure and I was fortunate enough to get this at or from Lunchbox or Bo Box Lunch. I really don't know what it's called. Um, it's my first, the first time I went to the store and um, as people post about it that they were carrying these in their stores, I don't know if it was Lunchbox or Box Lunch, I'm so sorry but that they were carrying these in the stores and then I went to my local one in the mall with the mask and they didn't have any but they were nice enough to order one for me so I got this today it was actually pretty cheap um, it's cheaper than what you would pay for like a Big Bad Toy Story and stuff I got mine in, t in total $83 and shipped with taxes and everything and um, yeah go check them out as of right now the recording of this video it is still $77 on their website. So yeah, I haven't had so yeah. I haven't had an SHMA figure since the 2019 King Ghidorah. We're now counting the 64 Ghidorah because we don't know if that's bootleg or if it is actually um if it is actually a real mold. But the box is pretty nice. I don't know if I'm gonna get SHMA often now because NECA stopped making figures, which is so sad. But you never know. I still haven't gotten a new tripod yet. I always should have. And I haven't yet. But, so, yeah. Well, I'll move this real quick. Here's the box, for those of you curious. Here's a picture of Godzilla in the front. And then here are promotional images in the back. The eyes are different, though. That's like one thing that's different, but with the reissue. It, the eyes are different. I wish they would reissue Kiryu, man. Like... That figure is amazing. But yeah, notice the eyes right here. Those eyes are totally different on the actual figure. So let's get them. All right, all right, all right. So now that he's out of the box, um, this figure is actually pretty good. You know, I don't have any QC issues with it, which is pretty amazing. Because literally all my other SHMA figures have QC issues except for Space Godzilla. But this is pretty badass. Not gonna lie. It's better than the NECA in the sense of, of accuracy and sculpt. I'm sorry, but it is. You know, I know this is a 2002 version and NECA is 2003, but I mean, the only difference is a chest on the scar on the chest. But this figure is amazing, you guys. It's really amazing. I do have a special color version 2000 because I never thought they were going to make a figure like this. So that's like one of the reasons why I got this figure. But. It's, honestly, this figure is pretty amazing. It's it's pretty amazing. I really want to do stop motions, but stop motions... <sighs> I can't do any right now because school's like too much right now. It's way too much. But let's zoom in on the eyes. So look at, look at the eyes on it. His pupils are pretty much... practically non-existent. You got a yellow line. On this side, let's see. You, have, you can see more of the pupil. He's looking like way up, which looks pretty cool. But I mean from the front angle, it's kind of like really wonky. And then on this side, you can barely see his pupil. And then this one, this is pretty much the only thing that I have, like not a problem, but it's kind of like just nitpicking on it because the first re release, you know, look at those pupils. Look at those pupils. But yeah, this figure is pretty, pretty good. I'm honestly surprised that I was expecting to the to be some kind of PC issue because of my experience with SHMA figures. But yeah, it's really, really impressive. Really good thing uh, that the leg just broke off. I'm like freaking tripod. Let's put it back there. So let's zoom out. More, 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 more. And you know, really, really good range. Really good range. You guys might try to find these just Oh crap. Okay, fix it. But really, really good range of articulation, you guys. Like, really good. The tail is surprisingly good. I thought it was gonna be like really loose, but it's not. This piece is just one big old piece. It's not rubber or anything, it's plastic. But I mean, just look at those details. Look at that. Just look at them. They're really prominent on this figure. Really, really good. I am kind of shocked because 
like I said, no QC issues on my figure. You know, it's pretty, pretty good, accurate. I really want to do stop motions, but right now school is just in the way. So maybe I could do a test, but that's, that's maybe. But, oh, this figure looks so amazing. It looks really good. Probably, let, me, let me get some figures for a size comparison real quick. So here he is next to the NECA 2003 version and the Movie Monster Series uh, 2003 Kiru, custom painted. And you know, these actually go pretty good together, these two, but these two, oh crap, let me just again. You know, they're actually both pretty good, in my opinion. I like the more stylized and paint job this one has, but I really dig the mold more on this one and the articulation. You know, pretty much the only difference is the scar on the chest, the articulation, and price range. You can get this one still for $25, and this one, if you get from Box Lunch, for a total of $83. So if you can afford it, I'd say go for it. You know, the original version is really, really expensive. But it's up to you. If you can afford it, go for it. But just, just look at the differences. Like, wow. <laughs> This is, oh my gosh, this is kind of cool. They both have actually prominent, really, really, really good details, but SHMA just wins out on it and details wise. I do dig the bigger scale from the NECA figure, but <sighs> NECA Playmates is fucking up NECA like so much. But yeah, you hey guys, thanks for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe. I know this is kind of like an awkward boxing video because I was kind of silent. Well, maybe not. And I'm just kind of amazed at this figure because it's really, really fucking amazing. It just looks so, so good. Thank you, Box Lunch Lunchbox, for hooking me up with this figure. For the help. I really appreciate it. Thanks, guys. Thanks for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe. Bye.